What's up, everyone? Welcome to Holly Scoop's Just Saying. I'm Kate Rocher. And I'm Madison Conklin. And today we're going to be talking about a little something controversial. We're talking about huge age gaps in celebrity couples. Now, yes. I think it's super weird. I know Madison doesn't quite agree with no. me. Wow, my voice squeaked because <laughs> I feel so passionate about this. She's really enthused about this topic, you guys. I think it's brilliant because with age comes wisdom and if you can spread your wisdom, your wealth of wisdom on a younger person in the world of Hollywood, by all means, go for it. I don't know. Whoever I'm dating, I do not need to teach them wisdom. They should already have that covered. <laughs> so we're talking about this because it turns out that Nick Jonas and Demi Moore are now dating. And that is a 30-year age gap. And I'm sorry, mm. but that is just way too much. And we all know that Demi likes to date her younger guy. She's a little bit of a cougar. With Ashton Kutcher was 16 years younger than her. And now she's on to Nick. And then Nick also likes to you know, date his cougars because he was with Kate Hudson, who was also 13 years older than him. So I'm sorry guys, but this is just, it's too much for me. Okay, woman hater. I say power to the women because if Demi Moore and Kate Hudson can get Nick Jonas, last time I checked in Jumanji, hello. He is <laughs> he so, did look good. He so good. fine in that movie. I mean, he is fine just in general, but like, I mean, she can teach him so much. Yeah, at first I was like, whoa, Demi Moore and Nick Jonas, like th that's a big age gap. But then again, like, see how successful Ashton and Demi's marriage was for however long it was. Yes, it ended, but let's be real. But it Mila failed. And, but Mila and Ashton were destined to be from that 70s show. But it lasted for years, and, like, the fact that Ashton grew up so much while being married to her, he was able to take care of her children. That just shows that this woman can teach Nick Jonas a thing or two about how to treat women. I don't Thank know. Thank you. But could you imagine dating somebody like two, three decades younger than you? I mean, that's a lot of difference. You're living a totally different lifestyle, totally different like mindset, all of the above that you now have to like Again, teach this person. Ah. An old dog can learn new tricks <laughs> and vice versa. A young dog can learn old tricks. So let's just be real. I, I think know. I have a soft spot in my heart for this because my dad robbed the cradle. My stepmom is 12 years younger. So I think at first I was like, dad, come on, really? And then I'm like, but look, they're so in love and like she'll watch his black and white movies and he'll watch her talk shows. Oh, it works awful. out, people. I'm just saying. I don't know, maybe I'm, I'm on a different saying. page because my sister's boyfriend is older than me and she's younger than me and she's not even graduated from college. So I'm like, this is, this is weird, please. Maybe please you're just me. jealous. May, no, gonna say no. But so these aren't the first celebrity couples to well, have. Well, think about huge... this. Can I go off of that comment? Yes, you may. Courtney Kardashian is dating Eunice Benjamin, yes. who is probably around Kendall and Kylie's age. Yes. Courtney is obviously nearing 40. But they've been together for almost a year. She's got three little ones that he's taken under his yes. wing. So I'm just, I mean, it's working out thus far, and they're even possibly talking about marriage. So it can okay. work, it does work. I'm in support of this. Okay, but then on the other hand, we have Scott Disick and Sophia Ritchie, who Scott is 15 years older than Sophia, and they're not working very well. I mean, she's already getting jealous. She's worried about him cheating. It's just, it's not going smoothly. Probably Scott is the exception because, because literally he is like a 15-year-old mentality, and so is Sophia. So that's not going to work. He's the exception, and he just can't keep it in his pants, okay? It, he does struggle with that just a little bit. But we also have Liam Payne and Cheryl, who are 10 years apart, which... Okay, they have a baby together, so it's a little bit better, but it was predatory at first because she met him on The X Factor, and I, I don't know. I like how you were <laughs> used the word predatory. It wasn't like she jumped on stage and like tackled him, was like, you're gonna be Watch mine. Liam. <laughs> After he grew up and became legal of age, okay. That's when it, it the sparks flew. Well, I, was, I was hoping she waited for that, and that would be good. Yeah, but I don't know. So weird. Too they much. have a kid together. As we saw, I mean, Louis Tomlinson and his baby mama, who are very close in age, they didn't work out and they have a kid together. But yet True. Cheryl's older, Liam's younger, they have a baby together, they're still together. Mm -hmm. Do I True. need to keep proving my point to you, Kate, <laughs> that this works and it is so hot? Okay, but then we have Beyonce and Jeezy, also a big age gap. Still he together? He cheated. Still so, together. But he cheated. Okay. I mean, come on. He can't keep it in his pants either, but still they worked through it. The younger was like, I'm gonna take the older back. Despite his cheating ways, you they learned mm -hmm. stuff from each other. Uh-uh, absolutely not. You cheat on me, this is not happening. Okay, <laughs> well maybe then you wouldn't work out with Jay-Z or Scott Disick. Yes, but no, clearly well. Jay-Z and Beyonce are still the power couple that they once were and will be continuing to. She is a queen, I'll give you that. <laughs> then there's also Bradley Cooper and Suki Waterhouse who also didn't work out and they are a 17 year age difference. That's okay though. Okay, so sometimes I'm not saying that they all work out. They don't all work out, 
But is it a cute attraction? Do I think it's hot that like a guy that's older likes a girl that's younger or a woman that's older likes a guy that's younger? Yeah, because if you got it, flaunt it and take it and run with it. For there as long are people as you can. the same age as you. Come on, like save some people for us. You, you gotta know? look for maturity, the wisdom, the knowledge, the emotional stability. That's what I'm oh. talking about. And the older people have it, and they can teach the younger people how to do that too. Like so, I said, I'm, I'm case not, in point, I'm done. Not I'm teaching hot, my I'm boyfriend anything. About it too much. <laughs> Well, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you think. Are you on my side? Are you on Madison's side? Is the 30 hot. year age gap weird? It's weird. Or no. is it like age is just it's a hot. number? Let I think us it's know hot. what you think in the comments. And then tune in next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.